The aftershocks of World War I and World War II are not over yet, but the world is already into World War III, and this time the winner is going to be the one with the latest military technology and second-to-none combat strategy. When Hamas from the West Bank of Gaza attacked Israel, over 1,200 citizens lost their lives and hundreds were kidnapped. This was the beginning of the most anticipated World War III. Besides Israel, the United States, Iran, and other Arab nations are also involved, and many nations are picking up their sides. You can better get an idea about it from the recent UNO voting against Israel. Time is near when missiles could be seen flying in the sky to Israel and Gaza, and it will make the world a battleground, probably leaving no one who could escape from this heat. However, the U.S. and Israel are already ready for this. The U.S. has increased its military budget to acquire the latest technology. However, Israel has deployed its Iron Dome system that shots down every missile that dares to enter their territory. From the recent Hamas attacks, it was observed that the Iron Dome failed to intercept many missiles that finally hit Israeli territory and caused many atrocities. To cover this lag up, Israel has come up with the world's first operational directed energy weapon system in the world, called Iron Beam. Let's get into the details of this system and how it will favor Israel in war against Hamas and other militant groups. When it comes to advanced military technology, Israel's Iron Beam stands out as a revolutionary air defense system and brings unmatched invincibility and efficiency. It has been designed and crafted by a team of 100 engineers from Rafael with aims to intercept threats before reaching Israeli airspace. Following thousands of work hours, the Iron Beam underwent a significant test in March 2022, and it clearly showed its superb ability to spot and intercept mortars, rockets, and UAVs in the Negev Desert. The Israeli Ministry of Defense made the announcement on the anniversary of a prior conflict with Gaza, where Hamas fired over 4,000 rockets into Israel. Fast forward to October 7, 2023, and Hamas sparked another major conflict. If the situation persists, the Iron Beam could reveal its capabilities, potentially altering the course of battles. Iron Beam is versatile and flaunts an unlimited magazine that is a shift from traditional weapons reliant on finite ammunition. While guns and missile launchers lose effectiveness when out of ammo, the Iron Beam relies solely on laser energy. This negates the need for artillery reloads, ensuring a constant and efficient defense. The primary cost becomes the electricity bill that offers an economical and sustainable solution. Moreover, the Iron Beam's speed of light attack sets it apart. It operates on light energy and moves at the speed of light, which is roughly around 180,000 miles per second. This makes it nearly unbeatable in speed, rendering drones, mortars, missiles, or fighter jets, whether supersonic or hypersonic, unable to outrun this technology. With a success and precision rate close to 100%, the Iron Beam swiftly and accurately eliminates its targets. The significance of these features becomes clearer when considering the time-sensitive nature of the battlefield. Traditional weapons, hampered by the need to reload, may cause detrimental delays. The Iron Beam's speed, coupled with its unlimited magazine, not only saves time, but more importantly, the lives of both soldiers and citizens. It is designed to intercept short-range rockets, artillery, and mortar bombs. The system has a range of up to 7 kilometers and can engage multiple targets simultaneously. The Iron Beam is expected to become the first operational directed energy weapon system in the world. The Iron Beam system uses a fiber laser to generate a beam of light that is focused on the target. The laser beam heats up the target's surface, causing it to vaporize or melt. The system is also capable of tracking and engaging targets that are moving at high speeds. The Iron Beam system has several advantages over conventional missile interceptors. It is much cheaper to operate, as it does not require expensive missiles. The system also has an unlimited number of shots, as it generates its own energy. Additionally, the Iron Beam system is much more accurate than conventional interceptors, as it is not affected by weather conditions or other factors. The Iron Beam operates autonomously, which means it minimizes the need for human intervention due to the impracticality of humans keeping up with threats moving at the speed of sound. With the ability to autopilot, detect, track, and neutralize threats, the Iron Beam is strategically positioned along Israel's borders, acting as a preventive barrier against potential dangers and ensuring the safety of the nation's inhabitants, 
including the military. This automated feature also facilitates easy training and deployment for allied militaries, with a particular focus on seamless integration into the United States defense system, given their active involvement in the Iron Beam's development and Israel's broader air defense initiatives. Israel's collaboration with the United States has resulted in a robust suite of air defense systems that not only promises to dominate future conflicts, as exemplified by the Iron Beam, but is already actively safeguarding the nation. Among these systems, the David Sling stands out as a powerful defense mechanism named after the biblical tale of David and Goliath. Developed jointly by Israel's Raphael and America's Raytheon, the David Sling is capable of countering various threats, including planes, drones, tactical ballistic missiles, medium to long-range rockets, and cruise missiles. Operational since 2017, it deploys stunner missiles at hypersonic speeds up to Mach 7.5, effectively neutralizing threats up to 160 miles away. Similarly, the Aero 3, also a product of joint collaboration between Israel and the United States, operates as a hypersonic anti-ballistic missile. It serves as an exo-atmospheric air defense system with a remarkable operational range of 1,500 miles. This capability allows it to intercept threats in space during the spaceflight portion of their trajectory, particularly crucial against Intercontinental Ballistic Missiles, ICBM. The Aero 3, in service since 2017, has garnered international interest, with Germany expressing interest in purchasing the system for defense against Russian threats. With thrust vectoring capability, the Aero 3's kill vehicle can dynamically change directions to keep pace with the maneuverability of incoming targets. The substantial cost of $3.5 billion makes it Israel's most significant defense purchase in history. Aero 4, a successor to the Aero 3, is currently in development and not yet operational. Israel and the United States have initiated the development of this missile defense system, intending to utilize next-generation interceptors and phase out the aging Aero 2. The primary focus of Aero 4's development is to counter more advanced threats, including hypersonic missiles. This system aims to provide an enhanced layer of defense for Israel by intercepting threats both within Earth's atmosphere and beyond, making it a cutting-edge technology on a global scale. Moving to the Iron Dome, it stands out as one of Israel's most renowned air defense systems, boasting a price tag of $210 million. Operational since March 27, 2011, the Iron Dome is designed to intercept and destroy short-range rockets and artillery shells targeting Israeli-populated areas. With the ability to function day and night under adverse weather conditions and handle multiple simultaneous threats from a distance of 43 miles, the Iron Dome is a versatile and crucial component of Israel's defense strategy. Each Iron Dome system typically comprises four launchers, with up to 80 interceptor missiles, and a total of 150 such systems can safeguard the entire nation. By late October 2014, the Iron Dome had successfully intercepted over 1,200 rockets with an impressive 90% success rate in eliminating targeted threats. Its reliability and effectiveness have been evident in the ongoing conflict with Hamas, where it consistently prevents missiles and rockets from reaching Israeli soil. Israel's existing air defense systems have become benchmarks for others, globally, and now, the Iron Beam emerges as a new addition to this lineup. Due to these, Israel military comes among the top feared forces of the world. The Iron Beam is itself a game changer for Israel's defense system, but it also acts as a mentor for existing systems like Arrow 4 and Iron Dome. With its revolutionary laser technology, the Iron Beam aims to further elevate Israel's defense capabilities, positioning the nation as one of the most protected on the planet. As Israel continues to invest in cutting-edge defense systems, the Iron Beam represents a stride toward ensuring the safety and security of the country against evolving and sophisticated threats. What are your thoughts about how Iron Beam will defeat Hamas? Let us know in the comments section. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel like the video and watch the next video as well. See you again.